normally I'm the star of the video, right? I mean, with a tire like this, dashing hair that's disappearing. That's not the point. We went to Instagram and have scrolled down our follower list, picked three people, slid into their DMs and asked them if they wanted to participate in a competition to win free video games, including Football Manager 2021. And we've got those three people here and ready to roll in a wheel of fortune that's going to pick the competitions that are going to eliminate two of the three and provide us with one Football Manager champion. And the games are gonna be random. Who am I kidding? They're not gonna be stupid, they're genius. Let's go. I've actually gotten three people to agree to get on Discord with me on a Sunday to compete for a free copy of Football Manager 20 or an equivalent game because it took us so long to set this up. You might be wondering why it took us so long to set this up. That would be because a lot of people thought I was trying to scam them, which is completely understandable. Who sends an Instagram DM out of the blue? But one of the people that actually did answer the Instagram DM is our first competitor, and that is Adam. I'm from Washington, which is the West Coast of America, if you don't know. I go to school in Seattle, University of Washington. I've been playing football manager since 2015, I think. My like most played game, so that's it. So we've met Adam. Now for our next competitor that has a chance to win over your hearts and minds and a chance to win themselves just a little more than an insignificant amount of money. Christian, live from Denmark. Hi. All right. Well, why did you answer the DM? Because I had a bear of a time getting people to believe that it wasn't a scam. Well, it wasn't until I realized it wasn't a scam because I at first thought that it was indeed <laughs> a scam. I was watching you. I was watching you as well on on YouTube while you were, while I received the text. It was a bit weird because I was you were on my screen and then on my phone afterwards at the same time. All right. Well, tell us tell us a little bit about yourself so that we can people watching this video can become Christian fans. I am from Denmark. I live in Aarhus, next second biggest city in Denmark. I'm studying, doing my masters in an analytical journalism right now, and then I'm just an all around good guy. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our third con uh, uh, our third contestant. We have Snabjorn. This is our third and final contestant. Did I say that right? Yeah, you 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 were pretty close. It's it's a Snabjorn. Snabjorn. Yeah, 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 you got it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it means snow bear. And just because my random selection of people from the Instagram, we landed two people from Scandinavia. Or is Iceland considered part of Scandinavia? The, the, you got two hours? I mean, it, it's a long <laughs> thing, you know. Technically, Scandinavia is like, uh, I don't know the word, but Scandinavia is this area. But now it's sort of become this, we call it in the Nordic countries. So we call ourselves Nordic countries. I now feel so much more educated. And something maybe about the Nordic countries, uh, because even Adam is apparently his, he's descendant from Denmark. So something about the Nordic countries just makes you guys actually respond to direct messages, <laughs> yeah. even though everybody else thought yeah. it was a scam. Did you think it was a scam? I, I did it first. I, I remember I, I was studying, it was midnight and I got the message and it said the old Zealand. And I was like, no, this is fake. This can't be real. Then I checked the account and it was you. So We're in. <laughs> huge, huge Liverpool fan. Uh, I'm studying film studies at the University of Iceland in my first year. You realize I have an Icelandic flag in the background. What did you first think when you realized this American had all this Iceland stuff going on? It was really confusing because I remember it was pretty long time ago now when I saw your first video, I, I saw the flag in the background and I was like, what the hell? And I continued watching and I actually, I, I sent you a, a Twitter DM and you featured me in a video with your mom. You're just, still, uh, you're just a lucky dude. I picked you randomly yeah. out of 3,800 people. And your mom tried to pronounce my name. And no, she didn't try. She didn't even try. I'm remembering wrong. <laughs> yeah, I think she looked at it and laughed and was like, <laughs> I don't know. So that was like, it's Icelandic. I mean, Icelandic is very, very weird sounding to an American dude. because the way it sounds doesn't match what you think Icelandic should sound like. I can't believe you're saying that to me when I'm competing with a Danish person. We're actually, we're actually forced to learn Danish in school. Danish used to rule us. How dare they? <laughs> we have our three competitors. We've got, <laughs> oh, he's got the Danish shirt on. <laughs> it's perfect. All right, the spinner is up. So for those that don't know how this works, which would be all of you, we have five options. We have three people. We're gonna spin the wheel. We're gonna hit one of them. Once we hit one of them, I'm going to explain what it is, but our five sections are among us. Zealand trivia, addicting games, fall guys race, 
and flag quiz. Once we complete one of these tasks, one of these people will be eliminated and they can go buy a Mr. Beast burger and be on their way. Let's spin the wheel. Hey, it's, going. Hey. it's going, it's going, it's going. What do we got, what do we got? Addicting games, yes. A very unsatisfying wheel. I'm not gonna lie to you, but we're on, we're on addicting games. You have five attempts to get five as attempts. far yeah. as possible in this game. The person that gets the least far loses and is eliminated. Here he goes. Oh, no! Sorry. Attempt number two. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get a, a run up. All right, here we go. Attempt number three. He's held it. Oh, he held yeah. it. Boom. He's through the first level. But attempt three, oh. level number Hold two. Up. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> that was expertly done. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what was that? Three? Attempt four. Oh, he's flying. Three levels down. Oh. <laughs> All right. Last attempt. Look at the oh. comp- Oh, no! <laughs> he got it! <laughs> he's through! You lucky boy. What level is he on? Oh, that was five, six. Yeah. Oh, no, six. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that was the easiest one. What? 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 No count. What? Ouch. Quick post-match interview. How did you feel out? I felt that I could have gone all the way, but the game was rigged against me. It just got warmed up. Burned a couple of early attempts there with the controls, but that happens. Christian, you are up in our addicting games competition. Oh, it's got Christian's music. Forward. What? Oh my God. Oh my. Attempt number one. Okay. Uh, nope. Nope. Attempt number two. <laughs> Attempt number three. Oh. Oh, oh, the backflip. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> He's through. Level two. He's got it. Go. Easy. Comfortable. This is the high definition footage you can expect on this channel. Three. Oh, oh. Life number four. Crunch time. Crunch is building. He's, he's got through. Okay. Ah, oh no! Last life here. Can he hold his nerve? Oh, oh, come on, come on, oh, come on. He's yeah. through. Come on. <laughs> on to the next one. Oh. Oh, 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 oh no! He's short. He's short. Oh. Adam is safe. And Christian is on the hot seat. Well, Christian, how do you feel? That was uh, that was right down to the end. Pretty nerve wracking. You struggled early. I had the disadvantages of, of the game lagging on the first round, but it's not enough. It's not good enough. I'm disappointed, Sealand. I'm disappointed in myself. It's not good. It's not good enough. I let my country down. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I understand the feeling. I feel it every morning when I wake up. It's nothing a few Cheerios can't cure. Ladies and gentlemen, our Icelandic representative, Snabjörn. Uh, oh. Here we go. He's over the ramp. Oh, oh no. That's that's perfect. <laughs> so nobody made yeah, it through um... the first level on their first life. Okay. <laughs> Second one. Aw, oh, Snabjorn. Easy. No! Oh, no, he choked it at the end. Yeah, oh, no. Snabjorn. Oh. It's heated up real quick. He looked good early. He looked promising early. Christian's sweating it out over there. Absolutely. Oh. Oh, he crashed! Oh. Again! He choked it again! Last life for Snabeard. He's got to clutch it here. He's got to clutch it. For Iceland. <laughs> <laughs> it just comes back, and he's the sitting shame. there like this. Well, that, that's, it's rough. Uh, did it did it get smoother as you were as you were playing it or? Yeah, I I got the hang of it at the end. If I if I waited a little bit before starting, it got smoother. But then it always got worse at the end. That's why it crashed two times at the end of the level. What can I say? The better team lost. <laughs> the better team lost. <laughs> well, Stabjorn, it's been it's been a pleasure, but you have been defeated. Uh, you can take solace in this. The prize is bigger than than it was before. You're getting a copy of Football Manager 2021, anyways. Even though that you even though you're finishing in third. Oh yeah, man! On. Oh really? Oh wow! Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that, that would just be cruel and unusual. You're the only person that doesn't already have Football Manager 2021 in this group of people. I feel like Oprah. Can I can I sit in on the finals? No. Good luck, boys. Um, Thank you. Unlucky. Thank you. Hope you hope you guys 
do good. After deliberation, ladies and gentlemen, we have settled upon a spinner that will produce our championship round. We have Zealand Trivia Fall Guys flag quiz. Which one would you guys prefer? Flag. Flag quiz. Not Fall Guys. Here we go. It's on the spin. It's your lucky day because we will be doing a flag quiz. Vexillology is just a very important part of this channel, apparently. Ladies and gentlemen, the final for free video games. Just so everybody at home understands the rules, the next time I hit next, they will be typing in a country, either in Danish or English, since they both speak both. And as long as they spell it correctly in one of those languages before the other person, they will get the point for that country. Some of them will be dependent on speed, like an obvious one, like maybe China or the United States. And some of them, like the one right here, might be dependent on knowing your flags really well. For Vexillology in the championship, you need six out of 10 countries to win. Three, two, one. Oh, close. Ladies and gentlemen, Christian in with the Algeria and it's one nothing. Oh, wait, hold on, I spelled it wrong. Oh, Christian. Oh, no. Just quite frankly, he was too fast. Slow and Stretty has won the race. Well, at least the first country. We have nine to go. Christian, I believe in you. That was lightning fast. Danish or English? Three, two, one. Oh. <laughs> Christian took it. It's one to one. Eight countries left. Three, two, one. It is not Brunei. Yes, it's the Maldives. So it is two to one, Adam over Christian, to round four. Three, two, one. Oh, Adam's cooking now. It's Tunisia. I like to see the freshman from the University of Washington. Three, one, <laughs> three, two, one. Oh, oh. No. <laughs> oh, he got it for the spelling. Three, two, Christian hits it. You guys had it. I'm just trying to spice it up, you know? Uh, fair enough, fair enough. You just wanted to, you wanted to keep it close. I respect it, but yeah. Chris, Christian gets his cosmic justice. That flag is also behind me, so that was fairly easy. And now we take a moment for our commercial sponsor, the subscribe button. Hit it, and we continue. Three, two, one. That's it. Adam got it with the Paraguay 4-2 cleaned up. And uh, Paraguay, not exactly a country. Not the guys though. Oh, the guy is the important part. Let's be honest with ourselves. The youngster from Washington has the lead. Three, two, one. It's gonna be some like Caribbean play. <sighs> Christian's got an idea. He's got an idea. Oh, no. It's not St. Kitts and Nevis. Are we waving white flags here, or are we? Uh, yeah, I've waved. That's a forfeit. A forfeit. Christian, this is going to kill you because this country is Antigua oh. and Barbuda. Okay. <sighs> I, 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 I wouldn't have gotten Barbuda, so that's okay. Yeah. I didn't know what to do because you got half of it. I can't just be like, you're halfway there because then maybe the no. other guy would, you know, maybe Adam <laughs> would be able to pick up on that. But it, the country is Antigua and Barbuda. Four, two, three, two. One. I, I can't spell it. Me <laughs> neither. Oh, the first one to spell it right is Christian. That's how you spell oh. Kazakhstan, and Christian's got it for three. How I know these things? I do not know. I wish I could make money from knowing these things. It's four to three. Adam leads. Christian on the comeback trail. Three. Two. One. Boom! Adam with the quick Latvia type. Oh, that is the margins. The margins. That makes it 5-3. Christian has been a bundle of anxiety and nerves since this started, but has hung in there. Can you discount the Dane? 
You can't. Three, two, one. There it is. It's Uzbekistan spelled correctly. Christian has swooped in and grabbed it. And Adam, with an opportunity to win the whole contest, couldn't fill in the first half of the stand, but I, I respect the love for the stands. I do. It is five to four. Adam has his second chance to win the whole thing. Christian can tie it, send it to a five, five sudden death flag off. Three, two, one. He's That's got it. it! It's Bahrain and we're going to a flag off at 5-5. Five, five. Oh. What a oh comeback God. by Christian. Is it is 5-5 five, five. for all the marbles. Two video games, pride and celebration in the comments. Eternal immortality. I don't think I'm overstating it. Sudden death flag off is in. Three, two, one. <laughs> it's Adam! No! I am a god. Right. What, what, what a competition. What a flag off. I mean, we had to go to sudden death. Uh, hearty handshakes between the two of you. Well played, well played. Absolutely. Yeah. Good game, Adam. Considering a selection of the general population, <laughs> I don't yeah. think we could have found two people that were better at flags. Congratulations to you both, uh, Christian. Before we say goodbye, your final thoughts. Absolutely deservedly that Adam wins this. He was best in both games. All right, Christian, you'll be getting a yeah. consolation game as well, just as our boy Snape Bjorn was. Uh, and thank you so much for playing, but it is time to say goodbye. Absolutely, it's been an honor, a pleasure. Bye guys. Adam, congratulations. Now, what was going through your mind when you finally realized that you had won the first ever competition I'd done on the YouTube channel? Um, I don't know. I just, I felt coming into this that like I could do this and I come out on top and three hours later I did. I, I feel, it feels great. I feel like I've, I've done the country proud, done the state proud, done a uh, teenagers proud, I guess. I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, my man, you get to pick a couple of games that you are going to get oh, from the wow. Steam store, and I'm going to buy them for you literally right now. So you've right, got your sweet. two games, the spoils of victory. Adam, the champion. Congratulations, man. Thank you. So grateful. Thanks for having me, man. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Huge shout out to Adam and Christian and Stabjord for participating. Christian took it right down to the wire. But Adam, the freshman from the University of Washington, the champion and really the rightful winner. You can never underestimate a man in a beanie.